Alright, let's get it. Got another workout for y'all. It's gonna be a fire one right here. Working on defense. My favorite part of the game, honestly. I was a defensive player when I played. Alright, so we'll be working on some defensive slides, slow and fast, and some closeouts into some defensive slides. All you really need is a resistant band and then two cones. If you're on the basketball court, then all you got to do is be inside the free throw line. If you're not, and you're doing it at home or something like that, then just grab two cones or just imagine, you know, a couple feet away from each other so you can get in some work. All right, so if you have the resistant band, go ahead and put that above your knees. We'll just go warm up the legs with some squats, 25 squats. We're doing all this just one time, a few resistant band workouts just to warm up our hips and legs. So 25 squats. Notice how my knees are following my toes. Don't want your knees to go in. going down to a 90 degree angle don't got to go super low just you know working on like if you were to sit down into a defensive stance all right next one we'll go get a little movement to the right so you're stepping the right foot out keeping that left leg strong and stationary as we lean to the right like if we'd be pushing off that left leg but right now we're not Stepping to the right, getting 25. If you have the resistant band, it should burn. 25 of them. If you don't, it still should because you're sitting down low in that defensive stance. 25. Burn it out. Got to get them all in a row if you can. If you got to stop and then keep going, that's fine too. And then we're going straight to the opposite side. 25. You want to try to stretch it out, big step. It's really gonna help you on your explosion with defense. Like I said, your knees follow your toes. So notice how I'm kind of angling it. If I would push off that right foot, then you know that's how defense is. You want to push off at an angle. Defense is all about angles. All right, so that's 25. Now we're gonna take it to a little diagonal. So not straight back and not to the side, but at a little angle, 25. Keep the chest up, core tight. We're warming up the full body right now. Warming up the hips. That's most important with basketball, especially with defense, twisting and turning. Are you guarding somebody? It's all in the hips, pushing off the, pushing off the legs, but it's your hips where the explosion is. Stand down low. All right, got 25 the opposite way. Like I said, at an angle, left foot at an angle. Toe and knee in line. You got the band on, it should be burning, but that's good. You want that, like I said, all the time, muscle endurance. Be ready in the fourth quarter. 25 reps. Try to go all the way through it if you can. If you got to stop, that's cool. And then finish it out. But 25. I'm doing all of these just one time. All right, last one. We're taking it straight back. So we went to the. We did our squats. We went to the side. We went at an angle. 
I was straight back. I kind of still got an angle, but as much back as you can while still keeping a wide stance. Like I said, warming up those hips. It's also core, everything, because you're, you're, you're keeping that chest up. So full body workout before we get into the full workout. Same thing, 25 reps. Once you get that in, you take it to the opposite side, same thing, straight back, 25. Trying to keep that strong foundation so when you're playing defense, you can sit down longer. Play defense for five seconds instead of only two. These are simple workouts that can help you be a lockdown defender. You can do this type of stuff every other day. You don't even have to do the workout that we're, about, that we're about to do after this. You can just do that. All right, so first workout right here. Defensive slides, but we're going slow and controlled. We're getting 10. Slow and controlled. Like I said, when we did the resistant band workouts, knee follows toe. You don't want your foot going straight forward while you're trying to guard somebody. You want to be angled. So you can push off and get where you need to be. Episode 10. Slow and controlled. Don't go fast. Don't go really slow. But just a nice pace. You're taking big steps. I'm getting in there in about three or four steps. I'm not the tallest, so if you're taller, you might get there in two, two and a half steps. All right, now we have the slow. Now we speed it up. Ten. Pushing off, still angled at the feet. Ten reps. We got ten slow, and then we got ten fast. Take your break, whatever you need, however long you need, and then you hop right back into it. Same thing. Slow and control. Moving the hands, because that's an important part of defense too. Hands, quick hands. Hands and feet moving at the same time. So it's the same thing, 10 reps. 10 touches you have the band on it should be burning that's how you get that that lockdown right here you can sit down low play defense for a long time without it you know you're not getting tired or anything that's what this is doing and we speed it up same thing 10 If you need to go down and touch the cone to make sure you're being low, that's what I did this rep. So I know I'm staying low. We're taking it back, slow and control. If you have the band on and you need to take it off, that's fine too. We'll try to push through it. If you don't got the band, it's all good. It's still tough just to sit down low and take those big steps controlled. Ten reps. Now this got to be your fastest one, the last one right here, fastest one. 
Hand. Hand touches. See how I'm pushing it? I'm imagining it's the fourth quarter. A few seconds left. I gotta get a stop. Alright, all done with the band. If you have it, you can take that off. If you didn't, you don't have to worry about it. Next thing, we're getting some closeouts. So that's not the way I want you to do it. This is the way I want you to do it. Knees bent, stand down low, and then you can explode it off. So this is the last workout right here. We'll do five each side though. Closing out, stand low, exploding out, and then you have a little back pedal, and you'll rep it out again. Five each side. So that's one. They're closing out, floating out to the side, back pedal. Five straight. Then if you got it in you, you take it right to the other side after your five. Same thing. Stay low, explode out to the butt. This is a leg burner right here. So you're getting that, that muscle endurance like I talk about. You're getting that in the legs right now. Keeping those legs moving. Like I said, defense is a lot of angles, a lot of movement, a lot of footwork. You gotta have strong legs to be able to play defense. You gotta have stamina in those legs. going three rounds on this. This is the second round. Close out slide. If you get tired, try to push through it. If you got to take a break, take your break. Notice how I'm pushing through it. I kind of slow down, but it's all good. I'm pushing through it. Yep, finish it out, take your break. The last one right here, you take your break, whatever you need. You got this last one. This is sped up, so you know I took a long break. So take a good break. Your last one gotta be your fastest one right here. Yeah, I'm trying to go hard. Going as hard as I can, last reps. This is how you become a lockdown defender right here. Lockdown defenders are relentless. And all the best players play defense. Two ways. Play defense and offense. And just know if you made it this far through the workout. So you do this two to three times a week as your cardio workout, you'll become a lockdown defender, I promise that.